Okay, here's your tarot for today. Uh, we're starting off here, and what we're seeing most of all is the... Mm, they're looking down backwards at this church spire, and the time is 5 to 12, perhaps? 5 to 12? 5 to 12. The next one we have here is... The three of bats. And what we've we got here, we've got these three bats are bringing a lot of romance into your life. Okay, this next one I've got here, six of pumpkins. Well, we've also got um, treats being put into your treat box here. And... Now we've got the five of ghosts and this pumpkin headed person has lost something and the ghosts are all coming around and going, what did you lose? Can we help you find it? And what has he lost? Well, maybe he lost his romance. Maybe he lost his heart and they're looking down here and there's water pouring out of this culvert. And how is he going to find his heart that was flowing away? Up here, what else have we got here? We've got amazing stars. Okay, it's going out of focus. Focus. Lots of stars. Mountainside. And they're still looking at the time. It's almost midnight. Was it? Who was it? Cinderella. Something happens at midnight for Cinderella. Is she going to find her prince? Is she going to get some treats? That's your tarot for today. Okay, as you can see here, this lady here is uh, going out to a ball, okay? And this fellow here is also going to the ball. Uh, the next thing that's happening here is we have a lot of spirits that are looking to come to the ball. The next one I'm going to look over here is uh, there because they're looking to see romance is in the air. Over here, uh, this person has lost something. Over here, we have got a bunch of, let's call them imps, and they have got arrows because they want to shoot arrows into the hearts because instead of being cupids, they're imps. Cupids also send arrows. These are like, well, they're for going in here. They want to create romance. Over here, this a pumpkin person and the ghosts, they still haven't figured it out. And down here, what have I got? Um, mostly I've got this kitty up here who is looking down at what's going on. And kitty is going, hmm, I would like some of these treats. And then here we have got a, uh, one of those uh, straw men kind of people. He's standing on one foot. And what is he doing? Well, he's trying to avoid the flames all around him. So he's on one foot, he's balanced, but there's flames in the background. So he's got to watch out because he's going to go up in a poof of smoke. Up here, we have got um, a little ghost who's very excited, wondering, is that a letter for me? And down here, what else have we got? Uh, I don't know. What else do you want to see up here? Hmm... I've got a pumpkin that's on the top of a candle. So again, watch out for fires. Mr. Strawman, watch out for fires. And if you've lost something, maybe you've lost your heart. And the imps are coming to help get you. Maybe you're going to meet this one, or maybe you're going to meet this one. But anyway, for Halloween, it looks like romance is in the air. Okay, what we have here is uh, this uh, fellow is uh, got a message in his hand, and he is going towards the river. He's going to cross a river. Down here, we have got an owl talking to this lady, and the owl is um, very perplexed. Instead of being a wise owl, this owl doesn't know what's going on. Up here, what have we got? Uh, well, we've got a cliff. You see this um, cat-like beast on the top here in the dark. 
he's on the edge of a cliff. Okay, down here, I've got mm, a bat and a bat, two bats and lightning. What's going on over here? I have got this ghost in the bottom of the car. This is the full card. This ghost here is waiting for treats. Because this one's getting them already. Up here, what's going on? I don't know. What else can we say? Okay, so we got... Let's put this face here. I saw a dog like this. This maybe is more cat-like, but it's a... I saw a big mastiff dog yesterday. Down in here, I've got a bunch of ghosts. They're all looking perplexed. They don't know what's going on, and it's the same as this owl. This owl doesn't know what's going on either, so a lot of questions. Maybe the answer is what's in this person's scroll here. He, This ghost looks very excited. Yippee! And the rest of them over here are not really too happy. So they're perplexed and they're, maybe they're waiting for a message. So for you, for the Halloween tarot, I'm going to say um, look for messages and they're usually going to be messages about romance and uh, you never know who's going to be knocking at your door. So you know, if you've got little ones that are coming for treats, make sure you've got lots of treats for them. That's the Halloween tarot. Here's your tarot for today. Okay, up here we've got the cat and the gargoyle looking down at this spire. And the time on the spire is just before midnight, okay? They're both looking at 5 to midnight. Over here I've got a new card. It is a horse, and we always say horses represent unicorns. And if you look at the top of his head, it's cut off by the edge of the card. But it's maybe it's an ear, but I thought it was a unicorn horn. And what have also we got here? Well, he's a knight. He's got a message. He's delivering messages on the back of his unicorn. Okay, and over here we have got the five of ghosts. Mostly what I want to be inspecting is if people have got good footwear. Uh, it's wet, so you need good rubber boots. Up here, what else have we got here? Mm, it looks like we've got snow on the way. The mountains have got snow, so you need good boots because it might snow. Okay, they're looking around at their feet. And they're seeing what's well, wet and it's going to be snowy soon. We need some good footwear. Over here, I've got a bat flying in below the heart. And it's raining here. So the weather, even the cat is going, gee, it's raining. The weather for Halloween is going to be wet and or snowy. So when you go out trick-or-treating, make sure you've got warm clothes and really good footwear in case it's wet and snowy. Get it all ready for your costume. You don't want a skimpy costume where you're wearing a bikini. You need a, a, a costume this year that can be worn where, where it's wet and snowy and cold. That's your Halloween tarot for today.